Rich, you know, Stanley was a very sick duck. Oh, Rob, no. Where is he? Rich, Rich, you, you've heard the expression, like a duck out of water. Daddy, is he dead? No, no, Rich, he's, he's alive. But he's alive because now he's a duck in water. Rich, I, I put Stanley in the lake. You put Stanley in the lake! Oh, on the stage, I mean, I knew every little back nook and cranny because as a kid, you kind of crawl into everything you can, don't you? And, you know, and then we'd have, like, uh, either Dick's kids would come over and, and or, you know, uh, Andy Gilbert's kids or, you know, because we all knew each of Jerry Paris's kids. And we'd run around the we'd run around the stage and sneak into little places and go to where we shouldn't be and climbing the ladders up into the rafters and all that good stuff. And finally says, "Hey, get out from there!" And, oh, sorry. Um, but um, it, the, I guess the, the the funniest thing is that Richie's bedroom never existed. You know, which is when every time you walked off the back of that set, it was just we just walking out to the back of the set and back to the dressing rooms, and that was it. And they only actually constructed it, I think, for two or three shows where they actually you were in Richie's bedroom. One was. Never name a duck where he came into my bedroom to tell me that he had to put the ducks back, and, and it was one of my, I think one of my best actual performances because it was the only time that I actually was had a, a dramatic kind of moment. And then the other one they did uh, where they had to, Dick, the FBI wanted to use their house to spy on the neighbors next door, and so they were using Richie's room to spy on the on the neighbors. I think that's about it. Mm -hmm.